Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. We are going back old school to the days of when I first started YouTube and I filmed with my iPhone. So originally I had wanted to make this next video, AKA this video, about my struggles with depression and anxiety. However, those of you who follow me on Instagram, which is Seattle MUA Renee, by the way, I am Renee, welcome to my channel. But after about 12 minutes of me getting into kind of my backstory and everything, my Sony camera decided after five years that it just didn't want to make videos anymore. So I have a new camera video apparatus situation delivering on Monday or Tuesday. So I'm going to film that video once it gets here. Otherwise it would be kind of like a two part video and it's not something I feel comfortable like putting partially up. So today we are going to be going through my limited edition MAC Cosmetics collection. Before we do, I want to A, let you guys know a few things. So this, this specific collection and this specific brand, as far as limited edition MAC brand items go, I do just collect them most of the time. I don't really even use them. So kind of like, you know, when you're younger, if you collect Barbies or you collect baseball cards or anything of that matter, I collect limited edition MAC items. Not so much eyeshadows, mainly lipsticks and uh, powders, compacts, whatever you want to call them. So. With all that being said, if you want to know and see what I have, then just keep watching. Also, as a lot of you guys probably know or remember, uh, my entire MAC collection was stolen about two, two and a half years ago. I did not have my glosses and some blushes. I had it kind of in a, this is really nasty, but that's just my, my, my press on nails. I even put them on for you guys. You're welcome. So, uh, yeah, that was in something like that. And I was the only person in my apartment community besides obviously maintenance and management that had a key. My ex had moved out and I had the locks changed. So I was the only person besides the community that had access and I went back to get it the next day, it was gone. So long story short, no, I didn't have insurance and the police couldn't do anything because I had no real proof other than pictures. I didn't have receipts for every single item. So yeah, I was fucked. And I could have just, well, I did. I, for a while, I, I cried and I mourned the loss. But there comes a time when you just gotta pick yourself back up again and start. So this is the collection that I've gotten to today. And let's just, uh, get started showing you guys stuff. Otherwise I'll be here and you'll be seeing this for the next 20 minutes. So in here I have all of my glosses. Some of them I have kept the boxes for. I've tried to do that, but you know, A, sometimes when you buy things, especially after they are sold originally retail in store, um, a lot of times when you buy things on eBay or even on Instagram or on Poshmark, 
sometimes you can get a better deal if it's not brand new in box. And by the way, I will let you guys know that I have repurchased a lot of the same things as much as that pains me. I just couldn't go on and I couldn't imagine not collecting MAC limited edition again. So I started over and this is where we are at today. Um, as I mentioned, a lot of my glosses did not get stolen. So a lot of these are from my original collection. The Alluring Aquatic Trolls, the Heatherette. I have a few of these glosses. Just love these. Nina, of course. Simpsons. Barbie. Man, Barbie. Hello Kitty. Heatherette. And Playboy are probably, I'd say, the most expensive um, as far as what they're worth even now. It's just, it's insane to me. And I'm, I'm a little bitter about some things, but you know what? I've, I've picked up, I've moved on, I've made peace with it, kinda, sorta, not really. So anyways, these are all my glasses. By the way, this is a lip gloss organizer from Sunny Cosmetics. You will see when I open these drawers that I do have a lot of their organizational drawer inserts. So this that I put my Mac in just for the sake of this video, this is actually just a desk from Ikea, but my vanity is over here. So I do have a full tour of my beauty room and makeup collection. So I'll link that on the screen, you know, I'll put it up that they're there somewhere so you guys can click and see the full tour of my room but uh yeah so this is my vanity and i have completely run out of room yes i completely took out my highlighters just so i could put one in this desk for the sake of the video so anyways, yes, I am running out of room and now I just got smart yesterday and thought, hey, you know what? There's hardly anything in this desk. I'm just gonna use it for this. So in here, I don't have much, but I have some single shadows and then I have some glitters and pigments, some Fix Plus. Um, this I know is from the To The Beach collection from a few years ago. And then this one is really exciting. This is lipsticks. All of my limited edition. I really am going to try not to show my toes because they aren't looking so hot. If you see them, I apologize in advance. So we have, you know, some Riri. Oh, and then one more thing. I just want to be flat out honest up front with you guys. Some of these are boxes <laughs> without lipsticks in them. And a lot, of, most of them do have the lipsticks in it. Like this one, obviously you can tell. Um, Riri, love, love this collection. That's another one that's pricey these days. Um, but like this one, for example, this is just a box and it was unfortunately a sad reminder that I used to have pleasure bomb, but now I just have the box. So yeah, whoever is out there that has my collection, I sure hope that you appreciate it and know what you even have. Just saying. So the, uh, I don't really know how to pronounce this. Gam. Batista Valley. I probably butchered that. Don't kill me, please. The Toledo. I love the Oxblood one. 
And then the new summer collection. Just got some of those. Those are obviously, I have the lipsticks. Uh, MAC, the Kristen Dominique Nordstrom exclusive lipstick. And then we have some of the Mariah Carey. These ones are just so gorgeous. One of my favorite packagings, I'd say. The Patrick Star. And then this was the holiday collection. So I have those. The Brooke Candy. And the, I believe this was, wasn't this last year's summer, I believe? And then the Boom Boom Bloom, more recent, love that one. Have some, these are actually uh, Heatherette, and I have the, I just found the sleeves for those. So that is exciting because, hold on. So yeah, oh, showed my toe again, sorry. Ooh, I wonder if I can crop it out. So I need to put that in here, but since I have to hold my phone, then we're just gonna, you know, deal with that later. So I got that, the Nutcracker Sweet Collection, some Trolls, Patrick Star Holiday. Gonna have to get moving here. This video is getting longer than I thought. More reread. There is a lipstick in here, so that's exciting. Alluring Aquatic. I had more of these, but for now, I just have that one. Aladdin. The, what was this? The Summer Heat collection? Cinderella. The Tribe one. So kind of, I tried to make these as organized and you can kind of tell I even tried to color coordinate them but as we go on it gets a little bit harder Aaliyah Hello Kitty and then this was um, another holiday one I loved this collection too the 2D Fruity and then these are some of the, the Raver Girl and the Party Girl ones. And then I have some more back here that I've repurchased. And either these, I know I have the box. I just need to find the boxes for some of these guys so that they have their little home. Ellie Goldie, and this was holiday from years and years and years ago. Star Trek. Uh, Zach Wilson. So, yeah, just a lot of ones back here, villains. So, yeah, that, that is lipsticks for now. And then, so the, this is another organizer. Damn toe, get out of here. Another organizer from Sunny Cosmetics. I'll leave a link below. And I, I don't get to say this very often, but I do have an, an affiliate code with Sunny. So I'll leave that all down below and you guys are more than welcome to use my code to save a little money. If you don't want to, you don't have to, no big deal. So these are some of my powders. Again, um, these I believe most of them actually have the powders in them. Riri. This collection, that was part of To The Beach. Cinderella, Cinderella. Kelly Osborne. The Dame Edna, I hope I'm saying that right. I have one of the Alluring Aquatic Bronzers. Aladdin, Trolls. This is a newer one, E.L. Seed. And then this was for Chinese New Year. 
I forget what collection this was, but it was years ago. And it's neon orange. Love it. <laughs> the Simpsons. This is an empty box. I will just uh, throw that out there. I mean, I'm not going to throw it out there, but you know what I mean. Aaliyah. Brooke Candy. This was, I believe, Holiday. Mariah Carey. This is that beautiful Omimi um, skin finish. This one, the new Dazzle Highlighters. And then just a random limited edition powder. And some of these. Villains. The Justine Sky. This one, I'm very, this one is probably the saddest for me. This is just the box, you guys. But I, I just keep it in there and remind myself that I will have it again. It's just so damn expensive. I had this and it had a little tiny nick in it. And so I got it for, I think, 60 bucks. And I can't find one under 100 now. If you guys ever see any, let me know for less than a hundred. I'm just, I just can't spend that much money on one thing. So of course I had to have this one, the Oh Darling. And then these are some more, not to be confused with s'mores. Now I'm hungry and want a s'more. I wanna go camping. Who wants to go camping? Let's go camping. I am so random. These are ones that I have purchased, but I unfortunately do not have a box for currently. Sorry if I'm a little shaky. Those are the wonderful benefits of doing this with my phone. So we have Barbie, Marilyn Monroe, Hello Kitty. Now I need to get my ass down on the floor instead of sitting. And then, so where were we? Over here, Nutcracker Sweet. I do have a Heatherette. I got it without the box. Otherwise, I think with the box, you guys, these are like $100, $150 now. It's just insane. Trolls, not that expensive. I, I would, I want to call it aftermarket because I'm also a car enthusiast. So, but it's not, it's after retail so yeah then I have some of the uh, powders the Mariah Carey the Patrick Star this is a pigment kit from holiday this these guys are super super old holiday is from I don't even know when little pigment sets I want to say that this was before I even seriously started my limited edition collection. So uh, yeah, just have some bigger items back here that just wouldn't fit anywhere else. I have another, what do we got back there? These I believe are pigments. They could be lipsticks. Yeah, but I can't open them. So use your imagination. And I believe these are either glosses or more. These are all from the same collection. But I mean, that packaging is just so gorgeous. And this was holiday. So yeah, I'm going to have to put all this back together like Humpty Dumpty. And then I have my limited edition. These are not blushes, but the rest are. And then I have some more uh, skin finishes and eyeshadow compacts in the back here. So I'll just show you guys these really quick. Of course, some of them I do have the boxes for. And then some of them I unfortunately do not, as you can see. So Sharon Osbourne, Rocky Horror, 
had a bunch from that. I had all the lipsticks, but yeah, those are, those days are gone. Uh, Archie's, Mariah, Hello Kitty. This is just the box, I know, sad, so is this. I just can't like let go of the box because it, it, you know, looks are deceiving. It looks like I might still have it. So in my mind, it makes me feel a little better. Okay, just let, just let me live. Uh, Hello Kitty. I forget what this collection is, to be just really honest. Alluring Aquatic. Riri, of course, love, I just love the rose gold. It just, it just does things for me, but no other collection can. This was part of that holiday collection. This is just a random limited edition one. That was years and years and years old. Marilyn, and then so back here, I have some more limited edition and rare mineralized skin finishes. This one I just picked up. So what I do as far as buying these things after they're in stores and buying them someplace like eBay or even on Instagram, you can look under the hashtag the makeup exchange and that's where people sell a lot of their own makeup. But just make sure that with eBay, you check out through PayPal and make sure that the seller is stating that the item is guaranteed authentic. And then if it's not, PayPal will cover you and you can get your money back. So that is just how I would recommend and the only way I would recommend for you to buy anything like this because you know there are there are people selling really good fakes I don't know how they make them but they do and it's unfortunate that that happens but you know a lot of people in this world just fucking suck let's let's be real I already showed you that one this one I love a lot of people ask me about this one. I, I don't know what collection it's from. It just says nude pink. So yeah, unfortunately it's kind of hard for me to get back there, but I have some more. And then these are some eyeshadow quads. Got the Riri, Patrick Star. Toledo. I believe this is a blush. The box just fit well in there. So this, this one, this organizer right here isn't from Sunny, but this one is. It's like a half blush one. And then back here, I just have some mineralized skin finishes that wouldn't fit anywhere else. So yeah, I also want to give a little shout out to my girl, Avita. She's also on YouTube now and I'll try and link her channel too. She was super kind enough to send me some things. I know she sent me these Star Trek ones and another few items when I after I had my initial collection stolen out of just the kindness of her heart, she sent me a few items that she had extras of. So I just wanted to take a minute to acknowledge that and to thank her. So thank you, Avita. And her Instagram is Avita424, I believe. I'll link everything below. So um, yeah, that is my MAC limited edition collection as this day, from this day, on this day. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. So as soon as my camera comes in, 
I'm supposed to be delivering Monday or Tuesday. I will let you guys know and then we'll have a more serious sit down, talk down, talk down. Wow, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. But yeah, we're gonna talk about depression and anxiety. And no, it's not a funny thing. It's very serious. So thank you guys for watching. I would love to know what your favorite Mac collection has been. And yes, I know this is a lot of makeup and you guys like, I, I just, I'm a collector of Mac limited edition specifically. So, you know, I, this is, this is something that I enjoy doing. This is something that just, I just can't imagine not doing. So I hope you guys like this video and I will talk at you later next week and probably also I'll be putting up another giveaway in the next few weeks. So I love you guys. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me. I am going to go take the dogs out and hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your weekend and I love you.